it's time to go to Vegas. I am so excited. I'm going to Vegas because it is officially the weekend for the Cheer Choice Awards. And the best way to explain the Cheer Choice Awards is pretty much like red carpet for influencers, YouTubers, and we get an award. I get to play dress up. So I will be leaving here shortly to get on a plane to Las Vegas. Cynthia, my cousin, is going to be taking me to the airport, so she should be here very shortly. A lot has happened this whole week for me, and it has been crazy with just a lot of my personal life. And yesterday, I was technically supposed to start driving to Vegas with my family because they are already in Vegas. And that couldn't happen, but that's okay. And I called my parents and I was like, I might have to take a plane to Vegas and then just meet you guys there. The good thing though, is I don't have to drive six hours there and six hours back. It's kind of nice flying. I will be flying completely alone. Nobody is coming with me. I know Lacey left this morning on a plane and yeah, now it's literally just me in my home waiting to get picked up and get to the airport. I'm really excited to be going to this trip and seeing what it's all about and I can't wait until Cynthia gets here. Cynthia just got here and I'm so excited. Now I'm actually getting like super nervous and I need to eat some breakfast. So let's go say hi to Cynthia. Hi! Like my PJs. And her PJs. She's gonna be taking me to the airport. Yes. Okay. She's nice. She's gonna carry this big boy for me. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's not that bad, it's right? It's like almost bigger than you. <laughs> okay. We are in the car and she's driving me to the airport. She's actually kind of nervous. I am just because I've never driven like in the airport before. And so I'm like, oh, if I lose Melinda in the airport, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think we're gonna be okay. And I was like, this is a perfect time to like learn, and then she just right. get, she'll get used to it and just get super comfortable. Because with people it. ask me like, hey, can you take me to the airport? I'm like, nope, sorry, I don't know how. Uh, so I was like, I'm making it today. Yeah. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> so it looks like I'm doing good on time. She got to my house um, earlier than I expected, which is perfect. I actually love that. So it just puts like my mind at ease because I just get nervous. And my mom always told me to always come at least like two hours early to the airport. So I'm doing that. And I want to make sure I have enough time to also probably eat some breakfast. So I should be. We did it. We're so nervous because we always, well, I always at least go with like someone with my family right. and then she I always like, go by myself. Like my friend drops me off and I go in by myself. But I always like game plan. Where do I go? How do I do this? What do I say? So. We did it. Okay. And she's going to help me and then I'm by myself. Yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Gotta weigh this bag. Under 40 pounds. So I made it through security just fine. I think it was kind of weird how they didn't use the buckets. So everything just had to slide on over. And I was like, oh crap, I have to put my everything away, but I'm good. So now I just have to find my gate. I found my gate and everything's good. So now I'm just gonna find some breakfast. They have a Starbucks that's right behind me. So I'm gonna go and eat some Starbucks. Nothing too crazy, but I do have a lot of time. <laughs> so I'm gonna call the family and just see how everyone's doing and probably just chill. Probably just chill until it's time to actually depart. So I just got my Starbucks and one of my favorite drinks is the pink drink. And then I just got like a breakfast sandwich. So this is like definitely my go-to drink. So good. Vegas! So it's currently 9.37 and my plane does not leave until, what was it? I think it was like 
10.50 or something like that, and then I should land by 11.33, so I have a lot of time left. So, I'm happy that I'm actually extra early instead of like late and stressed and not like running late. I would not want to ever miss my flight, so I'm glad I'm here, so I'm just chilling. Just give her a ring-a-ding-ding, -ding. I don't know. Hi! Hi! I got Good morning. <laughs> okay, so you know how you're like, be two hours early, be two hours early. Well, I am, and my flight doesn't depart till like 10.50. Oh, <laughs> I'm glad I'm not late. Okay, I just landed in Las Vegas. My dad is here to pick me up. So I just have to go to baggage claim and get my luggage and then meet up with my dad. I'm so excited. There was a lot of turbulence and I felt like I was gonna throw up at one point. And moving forward, when I fly, I'm going to start doing like a patch to help with like my sickness because I was like not feeling it. <laughs> my motion sickness, I was like, I fly like all the time. And this time around, I was just like, what is going on? This is probably my second or third time recently since I've flown where I just feel like super sick and I don't like that feeling. So, gotta get medicine now. There's my dad! Hi, Dad! <laughs> Good. Flight. It was good. Mm, glad you made it. Me too. Alrighty. Vegas. My dad's really tall and I'm really short, and this is always coming down to your level, I promise. So I thought my dad was taking me straight to the Airbnb that they rented out, and it's not. I was like, why are we in a garage? And he was like, oh, we're going to the... This is a Mandalay Bay. We're going to hang out here for a little bit. And uh, yeah, we've we'll seen that with Crystal and the rest of the, the kids. Okay, yeah. Flash adults. Awesome. They're still my kids, so I can refer to them. We're all his kids. I'm officially here. Yay! <laughs> I forgot my camera thought. <laughs> <laughs> That's what traveling will do to you. <laughs> I didn't feel much. I was not feeling good. My mom was like, are you doing okay? Because she knew that I wasn't feeling good either on the airplane. And um, my back's not doing too good. I did take a nap. Heating pad and Advil. Yeah. She's feeling better. So I'm feeling better because I was like, tomorrow's the big day. And I'm She's ready like, to have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone's being so nice. They're making sure I'm like doing okay, especially like dad. And they're just like, are you good? And I'm just like, yes, I'm good. And I really wanted to be here with the family. But I'm happy I'm here. And it's really windy. So let's just go inside. <laughs> We're at the Airbnb. And my mom got one with the pool. But the pool is nasty. Our pool was worse than this. Look, that first like, fact. And we all still swam in it. I know. So here's the pool, and everyone was looking forward to doing it. Yeah, maybe that isn't dirt. Maybe. 329 sees the dirt move. I think maybe just the plaster. <gasps> oh no, it's dirt. It came off. That's, I almost fell in the water. <laughs> oh, it is dirt. It's just. It's, dirt. it's just kind of dirty. Honestly, it was a cold though. Trust no. fall. Trust fall with mom. Yeah, mom. Uh, <laughs> maybe later. Guys, it's really windy, so I have to have to kind of have to yell. Um, but we're gonna see if Mark is trustworthy. Yeah, it's a trust exercise. But let me just have your phone. Oh, okay. Are you strong enough? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I have to go on the edge. Ooh, no, I have what? to lean back. What the heck? Wait, oh. See, it's trust. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, it's my turn. I'm uh -huh. not gonna put these in my pocket just in case. <laughs> are you, are you, uh... Do you trust her? I think I could do it, actually. Do you trust me? I'm kind of nervous. You trust me. Okay, go, go. Lean back, Mark. It's a lean back. You're not leaning back. I'm gonna back. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start leaning. You ready? Yeah. Oh yeah, I would definitely fall in if you let go. <laughs> uh... <laughs> 
<laughs> and I love Vegas. I feel like there's always something fun to do. Rather you're with family or not. This wind is getting ridiculous. I'm just trying to respect everyone that's still taking a nap, you know, and I didn't want to be like loud in there. So I came out here. <laughs> But I think we're leaving, so I'm gonna head inside and catch up with the family. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it is bright. The light is not the best. But we are on our way. And we're like trying to hurry because we're gonna be like three minutes late. Like you were saying that the show starts. It's like riding in the middle of the lane. Okay, we're good. Sorry. It's not us. It's not us. Oh, and then this Tesla. My mom was saying that the show starts like right at six. So we're gonna be three minutes late, but we'll be fine. Okay. You're so sparkly. I know. I get those more marks. I like it. You look beautiful. Thank you. We made it. We are in line. Already? I, I am, but I'm I'm nervous. I've never done anything like this. It's terrifying. I'm excited. I just want to sit down. Yeah, her feet are hurting. So. <laughs> Already. I, mine are too. These shoes are not comfortable. I they like look nice. yours. Those are nice. The studded? Appreciate it. Appreciate it. My goodness, sorry my voice is like going out, but we are home and we are relaxed. I did not film too much. I just was just so focused on the night and it was a lot and our emotions were up and down and my feet were actually killing me and there's Ariana and oh my gosh, like we did it. I know, I, I, can't, believe I can't believe it. Like as soon as 
like I literally was squeezing Luke's hand and as soon as like they said crazy pieces my heart literally sunk into my stomach I was like like there's no I was like Whoa, wait <laughs> <laughs> I said I'm so fat I'm ready <laughs> I'm ready but then when we got up on the stage I was like oh you yeah, know my, my heart gosh. was literally beating so fast I was about to have a panic attack I literally was sque yeah. squeezing your hands we were squeezing each other's hands I don't know if you guys are ever see that um piece or if Whoever watched it. Guys, um, it was so funny. We're so in sync. Like, our heads go just by from going down to going up to looking at each other to looking at our mom. Like, <laughs> crazy. It's, crazy. it's just a crazy experience. Like, I never pictured myself here. Mm -hmm. Like, going from nothing to something and actually, like, accomplish, accomp accomplishing, accomplishing, like, one of our goals is crazy. It's yeah. truly something. Like, yeah. ten years ago, or, like, even five years ago, like, I would never would have thought, like, wow, mm -hmm. this is us today, and yeah. I'm just so proud of all of yeah, us. No, yeah, no, I never would have thought, like, we'd be, like, a person people would, like, look up to. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Like, obviously, like, I always knew, like, siblings, obviously, you know, but, like, random people, because I, I get messages sometimes that's, like, oh my gosh, like, you and your family, like, are the reason I'm still here, like, you guys make me keep going, and I'm just, like, the fact that someone can really have such an impact on somebody's life like that is, like, actually crazy. Like, I didn't yeah. realize until going to that award show, because there were so many, like, good and, like, uplifting and personal, like, speeches that were made, like, hearing so many of the people that were there, like, being sober for X amount of years and going, having so many losses in their life, like, it's crazy. Like I didn't, yeah. I didn't realize like how intense it was, yeah. and I was just like, oh my gosh, Melinda, don't cry. But it was touching. It really did um, touch my heart with those stories and everything. Yeah. And I'm just like, oh my gosh. But it was such an amazing night, and I'm just so proud of all of us and the hard work. You know, it takes a lot. Yeah. And we've came a long way. We have, and we're still learning. There's always still mistakes no. to be made yeah. and everything like that. It was definitely a night to remember, and I'm so happy I got to do it with all of you girls, guys, everybody, friends, family. Speaking, I can't talk now anymore. I'm so tired. But um, we're going to end the night here. We have a long day tomorrow. Yeah, we have to be up early. Really? You early. guys have to. He's like, <laughs> not me. Sleeping in the car. I almost yeah. said van. We love you guys so much. We're going to end our night. Thank you for tuning in, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Good morning, guys. It is the next day, and I'm at the airport. But someone came with me this time. <laughs> My mom. Bye, everyone. She was like, I think I'm going to fly with you tomorrow. And I was like, yeah? And she was like, yeah. Um, but it's because of work stuff. Work, and I'm missing Aurora and Arwen, and I just, and Logan and Brody and Raylan, and we have all the, other <laughs> all the kids. kids at home. I'm just missing them all so much. So I just want to get back and do work stuff. But yeah. She's like, what time is your flight leave? And I was like, uh, well, I'm boarding at like 6 a.m. <laughs> and it's currently. 4.45, we technically had like an hour and 30 minutes and we're just sitting here and I don't know what we're gonna do. We might get some breakfast, but then that's about it. And we'll just chill and then get home. Get home safely. Yes, so I will see you guys here in a little bit. You're so far away. I'm just kidding. <laughs>